let's see what happens here. I mean, I, according to Kepler, Smoon and I are now orbiting with the same orbital pattern, or the same orbital period, excuse me. There's no way I can catch up to Smoon, but I can't get any farther away from it. All right, it is at this point, ladies and gentlemen, that I am open to suggestions. Um, let's see. If I, okay, let's think about it this way. If I slow down, then my periapsis will drop. If I speed up, my apsis will go out. No, my periapsis will go out. Maybe that's what I want to do. Maybe I need to speed up just a little more. And get that periapsis out just a bit. Oh, now my apsis is going out. My periapsis is staying pretty fixed. Oh yeah, because I'm at my periapsis. Okay, let's try that. I think what I'll do is I'll wait for the apsis to get a little bit farther and then maybe I can hit the periapsis around the same time the moon does. I mean, it's kind of a pot shot regardless. All right, let's do a stop with the engines, go to warp speed. Because now the moon and I will have a different um, orbital period. <clears throat> we should, right? Because I have a different, um, yeah, because I have a different velocity at that point. I have a different average radius, orbital radius than Smoon does. Just might take a while. What was that? Oh, oh, right. Smurth is going around the sun. Actually, what's the name of the sun? Okay, it's just the sun. Okay. All right, now I'm about opposite of Smoon. Hmm. Don't know that that's a good thing. Um, let's see here. There goes Smoon. There goes me. So I'm almost at a, I'm almost like at an integer multiple of its period or something or, or, or three halves of its period. Okay. Okay. Hold on. Hold on. All right. My velocity is currently going, taking me this way, right? Smoon is right there. Smoon is traveling faster than I am, so Smoon is going to hit there before I do. So do I want to increase my speed in this direction? Moves out my apsis. Oh shoot, now I'm at, uh, now I'm at a hyperbola. Um, ooh, 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 okay, okay, I'm in the moon, I'm in Smoon's gravitational field. Okay, okay, this is the farthest I've gotten. Hooray, hooray. Um, I need to slow down. I need to cut my engines as soon as that makes an ellipse around Smoon. Right now it's making a hyperbola. All right, we're getting there. We're getting there. I, I've got I've got a decent amount of fuel left. I think I can make this. I think I can make this. 
All right, that hyperbola is turning around. As soon as it gets to be an ellipse, I need to cut my engines. Uh-oh, I also need to be wary of getting too close to the surface of Smoon there. Oh boy, this is going to be tight. Uh, let's maybe increase the speed. What if I change my angle just a little bit, like this way? All right, I think what I'm gonna to need to do is make an ellipse around it, and then I need to broaden out the ellipse right there, because right now I don't have an, uh, a periapsis there. Okay, come on, come on, show me, show me an apsis here, show me an apsis here. Oh, I don't like this. If this thing closes up and it's a line, I, I don't know what that means. <laughs> uh, let's try maybe adjusting my direction a little bit. No? Okay, let's just, let's cut the engines. Um, let's see, I need to try going maybe like this way, kind of. I want, the, I want this thing to make an ellipse. I want it to close back around on itself. Maybe if I go fast forward. No, no, that's doing, that's doing the opposite. That's gonna be back to a hyperbola. All right, I need to cut the engines. Okay, um, maybe I just need to get, no, if I get closer, I'll be going too fast. Because when I get closer to here, I'm going faster. I guess I just need another. Okay, I tell you what I need to do. I need to get my velocity going perpendicular to my distance from the moon, All right? Because in order to orbit, in order to orbit, I need my velocity vector to point perpendicular to the moon, or perpendicular to the vector between the moon and me. As soon as I get that, I'm going to cut my engines. So, so this is the vector there. So I'm looking, yeah, yeah, I'm looking for basically to go that way. Okay, so I'm looking for these two indicators to line up. Fast forward. Because once I'm heading in the right direction, I just have to slow down. As long as I'm heading in the wrong direction, then I'm having to change both my velocity components. Okay, I think we're going to call that good enough. We're going to cut those. And now we're going to go do a retrograde burn. As I need to start falling in towards Smoon. Oh, my fuel's got me nervous. My fuel's got me nervous. All right. Uh, go ahead and up that to 100%. Wish I knew Smoon's escape speed. I can look up the moon's escape speed, but I, I the, the numbers on this are a little bit different, if I remember correctly. All right, is this thing curving at all? I don't think it's curving at all. Okay, now it's curving. Okay, I needed to fast forward. Okay, stop. All right, you have achieved orbit after 353 hours. <laughs> Oh, boy. Oh.